Hi guys, Gerald here. Today we are going to continue expanding the infrastructure in the United States of America in this hard mode playthrough of Transport Fever 2. Before we begin, I will encourage you to smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. And now let's jump into it. So I have prepared many many things for you for today. I really hope that you enjoyed them because they took me a while. I certainly think that they uh, are going to help me with the game and the uh, cities that I changed look much better now. Uh, one thing that I also decided I'm going to do is I'm going to put the date speed on half speed because I think I'm being too slow. Basically one year, an episode is one year and we are not even to the second world war so yeah i think it's necessary i will leave the game playing because i want to see how some of the setups i did are working but let's start first thing is first bermuda bermuda has an expanded uh, land even be from before i have also um, destroyed how the city was previously at least the majority of it built the streets as you can see they're much more orderly right now and the districts have uh, grown in a much uh, more manageable way what else to see um yeah so we have a um, station here now this one just with two terminals in both sides because i think <laughs> there will be not that much demand here also the cargo port and no wait there was there a cargo yes there was a cargo port here it's uh, a little bit changed as well uh, I think I also no everything is fine actually yeah okay cool and the passenger port as well is a little bit changed but uh, other than that everything else is the same here uh, yeah we also have public transportation lines we have one for the industrial district and we have another one for the residential district and as usual we have an internal line as well i think in this one i decided to buy the smaller trains because i don't think there was there's going to be that much traffic certainly not as long as the city is that small all right um i think that's it for bermuda i really hope that the city grows i think it has potential especially uh, once we see more destinations popping up and we deliver some fuel here because we definitely have that set up by the way do we have everything here yeah load up fuel and full load okay interesting why the ships are coming though they should be waiting hmm new york is unlimited right well i don't know we'll see maybe it's too early to judge maybe they started their journeys coming to here i don't know bermuda cargo port yeah i think i think they came out like that out of the uh <laughs> oh my god they are like attached to each other okay anyways this is going to get resolved with time so let's continue with turks and kaikosh islands uh, i i really don't know I, i'm i'm probably butchering it um anyway so yeah we have more land we have a uh, better district we have uh one residential i mean here it's a little bit weird because it's so small that it doesn't make sense to have so many stops so i have one residential and another residential and they also play the role of uh, i think this is industrial and commercial stops as well so in this case i have um yeah one residential line another residential line uh going let's see it so one going there one going here and there is one internal one moving between the two because they have access to the other two districts as well and respectively two residential buildings so these residents can go here and these residents can come here it's it's really nice there is also no cargo terminals yet because i think i might not even need that because this cargo port here has access to pretty much all the buildings that i might be interested in so i think there will be no cargo terminals over here uh so yeah we have the miami 
what is it, Miami to the island, and we have Bermuda as well. Uh, interesting, why we don't have the Bahamas? I guess I forgot to set it up or something. I think I think we wouldn't uh, get hurt if we set up a little bit more lines for this island. Okay, let's get one uh, from here to the. Yeah, both of them I think might work. Why not? Let's let's get it connected. Let's go to the Bahamas first because it's faster. So this is passenger ship, and we have I call them T and C uh, to Bahamas. Right? Yeah, perfect. Actually, you know what I can do? Maybe... But here it makes a little bit less sense. Maybe I can have one line that moves between these three ones. Maybe even I can add this guy as well. But these two are going to grow more. So I think these three are going to have one line. Yeah, that makes more sense. And these are going to be direct with the Bermuda as well. Sure, sure. Or maybe Bahamas, Bermuda and TNC can be in one. Hmm... That's not a bad idea. Let's see, let's see. So we have... Uh, let's remove it. Yes, I don't need it. Uh, let's see what we have here. So this is Bermuda. Bermuda has Bahamas, New York and the islands. Okay, let's have... Let's take this one. Bermuda, Bahamas. Okay. And we are going to manage it. Yeah, I also have put some waypoints, I forgot to tell you, around here so that they don't pass through the residential part of the island. But yeah, that's it. Uh, let's see, so from Bermuda to the Bahamas, and then through this waypoint. Okay, that's alright. And then I think I would like you to come here, and then from here go to Bermuda. And then I can remove one of the lines. Uh, <laughs> so add station, let's come here. Okay, and you can take whatever you want. Alright. And now I have three stations. Does that mean three ships? Oh, that's going to cost me money. Oh. At the same time... Hmm. No, I, maybe I will add... Maybe I will add three ships. It doesn't cost me that much and I want these islands to be connected, so... <sighs> Things that we have to do to connect the island people uh where is my do i have there we go no no it's not that this yes this okay uh passenger ones and can i have small how do i small okay yeah this is the smallest one to be honest nothing i can do oh my goodness it hurts why we don't have smaller ships i don't understand like some boats or something Maybe I can find something in the workshop. Mm. You know what? Maybe for now I'm not going to do that. It's just... If I just add one ship, it's going to take it forever to move places. So, yeah. Uh, I guess it's a bad idea. It was this one, right? Yeah. Let's remove this. Yeah, let's keep it like that. I will still add my line from... From here to the Bahamas. Let's continue. Passenger ship. B and C. Actually, let's do Bahamas. D and B and C. Okay. And passenger ship. I don't know if I care. Can leave it like that. Uh, let's take all of them. Correct. Here as well. Uh, <laughs> that's it, I think. Let's come here and buy a vehicle. Yeah, unfortunately, that's it. And Bahamas TNC. Okay, so now we have a connection between these two, which is great. Uh, here, terminals. Okay, you can go to one. Okay. Now, we have... What do we have? We have connections. We have connections to Miami. To Bermuda and to the Bahamas. Why not have one with Havana as well? But this time it's going to be starting from here. So Havana Island. I really don't care. Interesting, the small island having four terminals, the big one only two. <laughs> we will change that. Um, 
passenger ship. And this is going to be Havana C and C. Okay, and let's buy super expensive ship. Havana TNC, where is it? Havana TNC. Okay. And now we are much better connected. Do we have a Miami connection from here? I forgot. No, but we have New York. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's all right. Maybe I even overdo it a little bit, but who cares? L let's have it. Uh, oh, maybe I could have connected it to New York. We'll see, maybe in the future. Um, okay. Let's see. So, there is one thing I forgot to do in the last episode, and that is we are not delivering any fuel here, and we actually have some demand. So, let's do that. Let's take a line from the SCDC port. And let's deliver our fuel here. This is going to be cargo ship, and it's going to be fuel delivery B and C. I think I'm following my... Can we open it? Okay, let's spin it here. I'm following fuel delivery Bahamas, fuel delivery TNC, Havana fuel delivery. So, this one I caught first. The destination, no, this has to change. So this is going to be... I think I prefer to have what I'm delivering and then where it's going. Havana. Come on. Havana. All right. Okay, let's check the new line that I created. It's fuel. Um, SCTC. Uh -huh. I probably should first open you here and then I will check the terminals. But anyway, whatever. Uh, take nine, four, five, six, and seven. Four, five, six, and seven. And what did they say? Nine as well. Four, five, six, seven, nine. Okay. Works for me. Max stop time unlimited. No, let's do 10 minutes, actually. And full load. And the only thing you have to do is load fuel. And here you have to unload. That's it. And unload fuel, please. Load fuel. So load fuel. Unload fuel. All right. And let's take a ship. Cargo, crude oil. My favorite ship. And assign it to fuel delivery TNC. 21. So two ships? Three ships? What are we looking at? Oh, I will have to give it some waypoints as well, I think. 43. Okay, let's start with two ships. And that's going to go to 41, which is okay. And I hate to see, I think, this line. Do I? Mm. It's looking fine, I think. I can still add it the waypoints. I don't know if it matters. I have... What is it? Commercial here? Yeah, no, I don't think it's... It's bothering anything. Okay. Works for me. Oh, I didn't give it alternative terminals, right? No. There we go. Perfect. Uh, and I was supposed to actually see... What did I do here? With the terminals? No, I don't have double terminals, so that's okay. Uh, this one... I should probably... Oi, sorry. Clicking buttons become this. Cool, so we're delivering fuel to the TNC now. That's perfect. Um, let's review Bahamas. So this is how the Bahamas look. I have not expanded it uh, at all, I think. And other things that have changed. I removed this port from here. I moved the port here. Uh, we have passenger and cargo ports at the same time. A bunch of people waiting to the Miami Bahamas, which is good. We have a station now. Did we have before? Maybe. Uh, but we didn't have public transportation, I think. That's certain. So we have a commercial line. We have a, a residential one line. And residential two line. Uh, I don't have a 
industry one because all the industries are on this station. Maybe maybe in the future, I don't know. Potentially not. We'll see. Uh, you are invading another district. There is enough space to grow here. Uh, yeah, so... Ah, also, of course, we have... Oh my god. Yep. Uh, we have an internal line. This one. And another one here. Um, this one doesn't probably function much right now. But when this grows, I wanted to have it here and set up. So I think I like it like that. Yeah, this was... This is terrible. I hope two drums help. But we'll see, we'll see. Anyway, um, yeah, we have... Bahamas, Miami, Bermuda, TNC. Cool, we don't have Havana connection, but... Uh, when I add this, I think I will have one. The Bahamas can be connected to something else, but we'll see in the future. Um, cities have, uh, have to be connected, you know? Maybe to Savannah if I add it a port, but we'll see, we'll see. Ooh, that looks nice. Nice. We are growing here. Alright, that's Bahamas. And let's go to Havana, I think it's the last one. Last uh, island that I changed. It's very, very changed, believe me. Uh, the districts are now spread in a very good way. Man, this is space for the commercial. Can you can you not grow here? That would be great. Okay. Um, I don't know. I think we didn't have that. I think I also reworked the port as well, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Havana should be better connected as well. Yeah, maybe I will connect it with something here if I decide to build a port around here. Maybe New Orleans is going to get a port. I think I might be able to connect it to everything. Anyhow, uh, yeah, we have the fuel delivery here as well. 40. 40 is probably too much. We have um, a residential district on this side, commercial and industrial. And we have one residential stop, one commercial stop, and one industrial stop. We have commercial line. Industrial line and residential line, and one internal going to commercial and to industrial as well. Okay, and I think that that's it for the islands. I really hope you like it, guys. I actually think Havana has huge potential, has a lot of space. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. All right, um, what's next? Aha, uh -huh. yes, of course. I spent a ton of time creating Oklahoma as well. This is the station in Oklahoma. You already know the station design, so shouldn't surprise you. I also have already built this cargo, the second uh, two cargo terminals, because this food processing plant is going to be in use hopefully very soon. Uh, what else did I do? I also finished up Austin. Ah, oh, yeah, of course. I finished up Austin here with the, the rail connections. And I improved on the tunnel like I promised. It looks much better now. I really think so. From this side and from the other side as well. Even, you can say, it looks kind of realistic. Although this is a lot of inclination here. But, yeah, what can you do? Austin also got a more separated uh, district. I have also added three stations and hopefully in this episode I will build the public transportation. The same goes for Oklahoma but without stations. We will see what uh, what's going to happen there. Alright, um, before I start doing other things, let's check our stations. Oh my god, yes, Havana, Cuba. No, uh, station, commercial. Actually, it's not only commercial. I think this gets some residential people as well. Yeah, I think... Oh, I even bought... Why did I do that? The small train. Wow. That was a mistake. Replace with the big one and copy it. Cool. Uh, we already did this one. Mediocre in Houston. Okay, Houston might... Uh, who, what are you waiting uh, 
in the internal one. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, and here I have buses. Is that a bus? Ah, yeah, I started adding buses in these lines. I really hope I can replace you with... Mm. Let's see if... Is this line connected to... Let's spin it here. Let's see if I can add trams. That would be great. Uh, what do I do now here? And tools and tram track. Uh, with the exception of here. I think everything else is covered. Pretty much. So we can go to the... Come on. To the depot. Buy one. And add it to the Houston internal one, right? It's the internal one. Cool. And we can sell this one probably. It's already in bad condition, which is interesting. Okay. Let's continue. So I did this to Oak Street in the Bahamas. For rest one. That one definitely... Oh... We lost that building. Maybe we need another one. Let's 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 see how it goes with two, eh? Uh, Havana, Cuba, rest one. Okay, I think we can give you one more. What else do we have? I think this is it. Everything else is very good. Uh, still, uh, although says very good, maybe I can. Did I did I do wrong? Yeah, click this. Oh my God, Savannah! Can I pause the game because this is constantly jumping? Ah, yeah, the clocks. Okay, I really hope I will be able to finish the clocks now and then add uh, more ICR lines as well. Because even if I fix that now, then I will have to come back and fix it again. Panama Panama has on the clocks. But still, you know. Maybe it's just here. Let's see, Charlotte. New York East Circle. Oh yes, that's the ICR. But that's not going to be finished in this episode, but maybe in the next one, we'll see. It will be great. I mean there is a lot of traffic in this circle around here. It's not really a circle, but like in this few cities that are kind of close together hopefully i will be able to to uh, relieve some of that passenger pressure east circle as well mm, maybe because i have very few oh, managed vehicles i only have one train for the whole east circle really that does that make sense let's replace you all together uh, I have this, but this doesn't work for me. Certainly doesn't. Well, we're going to be super long, very expensive. So let's do this. That has 80 capacity like that. And this has 52. How long are you? Let's see. 81 meters. Nope. I don't think you work for me. It might, but probably not. It has 52 capacities fast. I don't need fast. Nah. Let's do this. This is going to bring it to 36. And then let's also give you another one. I don't know how I did that. This has four stops, which requires more vehicles for sure. I guess I got confused or something. You know, let's copy and then let's edit everything. Something like. Ah. Something like this. I hope that helps now. We'll see what happens with this line later. Okay. Uh, where was I? Stations. New Orleans. Yeah, that's the clock again. It is possible to uh, make them bigger now as well. Let's see, we have six stations and six trains respectively everything is bad so we can all together replace with a triple one 
Okay, hopefully that's going to help. Uh, I was at New Orleans, New York. New York, 500 people for you should be good. Yeah, we just fixed that one. Atlanta. Glory the circle. Glory the circle. It's making money. How is Florida Circle? Mm, some people waiting here. Let's actually see the line like this. So, some people waiting here. Some. Ooh, a lot of people waiting there. Some people certainly waiting here. This is not in the Florida Circle. Which is interesting. Maybe I can add it if. No, but Charlotte and Savannah have a connection. These guys have as well. Yeah, they all have, so no need. Uh, Florida Circle. Miami is also in Florida Circle, right? Yeah. Ooh, I actually think... I actually think I might be able to expand this. Yeah. Hmm. Let's see. Let's select them all and replace them with a triple one. Cool. Let's see how that goes with time. Okay, um, hmm. maybe I will very quickly go through. So we did Florida Circle here, Florida Circle here. Yeah, that's the clocks. East Circle we did as well. Wash Atlanta. Oh, yeah, certainly. And in Atlanta, no one is waiting. Maybe people haven't even managed to go to get from Washington to Atlanta in order for people to want to go back. But you know what? Um, absolutely, that was a new line. So let's just replace everything with a double train. Cool. Here, East Circle, we already fixed that. Oi, sorry. This one looks good. Okay, we... Did pretty much everything necessary here. Is circle as well. The clocks. The clocks probably I will fix now. Another one. And this one as well. So. Let's go. Let's do it. Time is... Uh, the clock is ticking. Time is running out. Hi guys. And we are back. But this time. I have finished. All the construction. And putting the signals. So let me show you what I did. So first let's go with Austin. So from Austin we continue and we make a small turn. What's the idea? The idea was two things. First I wanted to be a little bit lower with this rail. So that I can go on top with the other one. and have a tiny cute bridge over here. I think it looks amazing. Actually this happened automatically. I didn't even have to do that much. Anyhow. Uh, this... Um, Rail is going to the direction of Denver, potentially in the future, continuing north and connecting other cities around here. Um, maybe we can have a turn towards Santa Fe. I don't know. We will see. And yeah, that's it pretty much for uh, Austin North going rail. The other one here was from uh, built a long time ago. It was pointing this direction, I decided to first continue building it and eventually maybe again go to Denver and Denver is going to extend to other places, we'll see, I don't know. It's going to happen, well, it's going to happen, right? And yeah, Kansas obviously is going to be connected here as well. And then I opened uh, a turn here towards Oklahoma after the bridge. I think it looks pretty pretty good because it's uh, surrounding this supposedly to be a mountain kind of hill thingy <laughs> and yeah i think it looks pretty good it's connecting to oklahoma and this is going to allow me to finish a lot of things that i already set up in the last few episodes speaking of that let's uh, do a few things so that i can uh, finish what i'm talking about now, in Oklahoma, we don't have stations yet, but stations are easy to place, so let's see. So I have residential here, industrial here, 
and commercial on that side. Like this city is probably going to be a lot of squares as well. So let's let's help it a little bit first. Um, hmm. City streets, which one are we having here? Both. But I prefer these ones. Let's take it. Let's connect over here like that. Uh, I don't want ownership. And this looks good. I hope it's perpendicular, but even if it's not, I cannot do anything about it. Let's take this from the middle here and get to here. Okay. Cool. Now, uh, same goes this way, like this, and maybe do that. Cool. It's going to continue growing. Uh, with squares, I'm pretty sure. But now I think I can set up at least two stations. The commercial uh, probably doesn't deserve yet. It's too small and we already have that station here. But I can put a residential station over here. So let's go. I think this is a pretty good spot. Here or here? I think this one. Yeah. Here in the middle. Let's put it. Boom, boom. Okay, and the industrial is going to be probably here. I think it's a, a good place. It's far enough. And Oklahoma is going to grow very, very fast after we connect it. So let's do that. Now, we start with the lines. New line. Start from here to the Oklahoma Central Pass. This is going to be our RS1. Of course, let's change the color. Change the name to PT. Oklahoma RS1. Let's give it alternative terminals and load it up here so that we can add the tram lines. Another one. This was industrial. Which is going to be int one. And we are going to add PT Oklahoma int one. Alternative terminals and color open put it up here and another new line is the first internal one from residential to industrial and that's it nothing else let's give it i don't know this color pt oklahoma internal one beautiful okay how do they look ah this is cute okay I think I like them. Let's open the last one. Very quickly, let's check the terminals here. Of course. Let's put this one on a separate terminal. <clears throat> and let's upgrade the drum trucks. Okay, starting from here. Boom, boom, boom. All of them. There we go, coming up here, upgrading one by one. This is red, this is red, everything is red. Now everything is blue, right? Yeah, okay. I see some... No, I guess it's fine, it's the yellow one. The yellow one could be coming from the top, maybe? Yeah, we'll do this. We will add a waypoint. Let's add a waypoint here and here. The same goes for the other side. And now we can force the yellow one to come. Where is the yellow one here? Manage line. And after int, let's add this station. Perfect. Same goes for the green, I guess. Let's make a circle this one can you come here yes good good now the question is do i have everything upgraded again nope <laughs> so let's upgrade some more and i think that looks better perfect last but not least ram depot 
Let's put it at the edge of the sea somewhere. And this is not going to be the edge eventually, but for now, put it here. Why not? Yes. Okay. And of course, it's already blue from before. <laughs> I don't know. Yes, it makes sense. Uh, oh. Now, let's buy our vehicles. Uh, residential, definitely. Okay. I'll give them all one. And what's the problem? Oklahoma, green. Uh, also, do I see you returning or something? What's... Ah, no. Something is not connected properly. Uh, here? Interesting. Okay. Okay. Is she set up? Perfect. Okay. And the last one before we are ready is Austin. Come on, Austin. Let's make you very quickly. New line. Uh, I forgot everything about Austin. So this is res. Let's do this. This res one. Oh, and this is not this name, certainly. So this is going to be Austin uh, Central Bus. We give you all the terminals and a green and the Austin Res 1. Perfect. Uh, while I'm here, I realized that our city Ah, no. Our city has a good name. Well, I already changed it, it appears. This is Cargo Rail. Ah, this one is not proper. Austin Central Rail. Perfect. Okay. Uh, let's also put this one here on top. And add a new line. This will be industrial and this commercial, so... Let's add commercial one PD Austin commercial one. Oi, didn't click it. And color and open. And new line. And that one is oi, not this. First this. That one is int one. And color and name. Austin, wait, Austin means one. And terminals is the last thing and open it here and let's upgrade. Oh no, wait, uh, we need res com res int. Okay. It's looking good. Only here is probably, no, it's looking good. Okay. And this is going to be D. Austin int one color is whatever looking good cool uh, just open it here and yeah of course why not <laughs> let's put them in separate terminals you as well uh, and actually let's check these guys as well yeah, this is good at least this is fine, though I prefer if you go there as well. And here, home one goes to terminal one. Good. Okay, everything is looking very, very nicely. I'm loving it. Let's upgrade the trams. Here, what did I do? Certainly, everything is blue now. Upgrading, upgrading. Coming here for the green. Good. Uh, more here. This is okay, done now. And only here is left. Everything is blue now. Seems so. 
All right. So the tram depot. Hmm. Let's see. Let's put it over here. This. Buy. And put it on res. Int. Com. And int. Cool. Everything is set up in Austin as well. So now comes the explosion of growth, potentially. I really hope so. Let's see. What do we start with? Let's start with the clock. So the clock. Uh, yeah, the clock is coming on the right. So the clock has to continue on the right. On the right here. And I'm actually probably going to remove Nashville from the clock. And we are going to go to Atlanta directly. Certainly. And we're on the right. Yeah, so let's go from the right. So this means... Uh, wait, we were already in New Orleans. So this is Houston. So from Houston... Where is Houston? Is here. Let's go to... Austin. Austin Central Rail. Okay. This is going to be the first line that's going to go to the right. So you're going to take... 13 and then you're going to take uh everything from 11 to 16 it should be right yes 11 12 14 15 16 do i see that one of the terminals is not connected which one terminal 9 uh -huh. okay finally connect Cool. Uh, so we added Austin. Austin is already here. Okay, after Austin, we are going to add Oklahoma. Come on. Perfect. And in this case, it's one. Oklahoma is one. And then is everything up to six. That's perfect. And after that, we remove. Interesting. Why you want to return? Why you don't go forward? Ah, there is no connection, of course. We remove Nashville. And there we go. The line is now using the new rail. That's a lot of. That's a lot, a lot of. <laughs> a lot of distance, man. Hmm. Doesn't matter. And coming up to here. And from Atlanta going to Savannah. It's beautiful. Okay. Uh, that's it here. Uh, the only thing I have to do is... Copy. Very good. Actually, let's replace everything. Select everything. We add the two new ones. And replace these guys with new ones good now the SE clock if i'm not mistaken had a ton of people waiting in some places yeah maybe maybe it's a good idea to to increase it in size yep so manage vehicles Wait. edit no it's going to be so much faster there we go. Let's make them bigger. I will see how it goes in the next episode. But for now, I think it's good. Uh, actually, let's play the game. Uh, and the other one. Counter clock. Okay, counter clock. Where should we pick you up from? From Nashville? No. So from Houston. In this case, we are going the other way. So from Atlanta. Yes, from Atlanta. We're going to add... We're going to remove Nashville. And we're going to add this station. Though I think it's going to be so much slower if I uh, don't pause the game. And here is going to be... Come on. 
Come on. 13. And then 11 to 16. Oh my god, the luck. 11. No, 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 no. I'm definitely pausing. This is unbearable. 12. Oh my god. Seriously. How many frames is this? Oh, every fourth second a frame. Cool. Thank you, game. Okay, and after Oklahoma, oh, you're already going this way. Uh, because you're going to Houston, yeah, because it's starting from Houston. Good, good, but in the meantime, you should stop in Austin as well. And in Austin, we're going to take one. And here is two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. And then from Austin to Houston, Houston, New Orleans, Panama, Savannah, Atlanta, Oklahoma, Austin. It is great. Okay. Now the question is, do we have so many here? Here, not that many. Here, certainly some. There is some here as well. Not that many here. I don't think that one is so busy, so I think I'm going to leave it like that for now. So these are the two uh, commuter service clocks, right? Did I already set up some ICRs for these guys? I don't think I did. ICR Florida, Miami, Wash, Miami, Atlanta, Wash, Atlanta. Okay, this is this is good and all, but we don't have ICRs jumping over cities. Problem is that now Nashville also has very few connections. I will have to figure something out for Nashville in the future. Because it's not currently part of the circles. Maybe it's going to become part of the circles? So maybe it's going to be like... Ah, Savannah. Nashville. Austin. New Orleans. Panama. Atlanta. Oklahoma, Houston, and then what? And then I have to have another connection somewhere. Panama Savannah, do I have Panama Savannah? Yeah, I have it in the circle. Maybe from, from New Orleans to Nashville again? Because that's where I started, right? And that way Nashville is going to get a connection. Spanama is certainly connected. Yeah, I think that works. So, so let's repeat again. So Nashville. No. What did I say? Savannah. Nashville. Austin. New Orleans. No, Atlanta. It has to be from Atlanta as well so atlanta nashville that's going to connect these two which are next to each other and then it's going to be nashville austin new orleans savannah and then i can connect savannah savannah nashville hmm questions questions you know i'm trying to figure out how to to make um ICRs in this circle again without having trains coming back and forth. I think I will figure it out, but uh, for the next episode, I have already fixed these uh, SCRs, uh, sorry, CSRs. So that's a pretty good start to see how things are going to go. And I'm going to plan what to do with the. Um, uh, intercity rail lines in the meantime though i certainly want to check a few things okay, this one is getting better hmm. by the way do you know what i realized i realized that this here is very very close very close to the ocean that means 
this opens potential for shipping and we love shipping don't we <laughs> i think i certainly do and that's going to remove a few trains if i connect this here with ships so i think i'm going to do that so it's going to be the last thing uh, i'm going to do in this episode but let's see let's see cargo port how are we going to do it where so the ships are going to come from there so if i put it like here i think that's a good idea maybe here as well yeah here it works as well it's close there it's going to get the connection here i open oh yeah i think that's going to work let's see like like this maybe even closer to here let's make it parallel perfect now let's beat our ugh, beat build ourselves a road and uh, not one way uh country road like this one yeah that works let's build it like this and then connect it maybe here actually that and okay, this looks good okay this cargo port now has access here let's configure it that's going to be quite a few ships actually i think because we need a 400 rate and that's a big big distance still is going to generate me money but you know that's the question i should ask myself because they're going to have to do all of this but i'm still going to remove trains passing through here because i think i think that's a very good idea okay uh let's do it let's do it let's do it and see how it goes uh okay, let's remove these and have a cargo on both sides i think i can remove this land here as well let's start with one and see or set up the line and see how many ships that's going to be because if it's some insane amount, I don't think it makes much sense. Let's uh, add a new line. And let's do... Because I will also have to add more terminals here. Let's do this port. To this port. Okay. That's line one. Perfect name. Let's buy one ship. This type. And assign it to this line. 18. 18. Oh my god. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, I don't think that's going to work. Because I will have to buy 20 ships. 20 ships. Is it crazy? Is it insane? Guys, you know what? You have to tell me. Tell me in the comments if you want me to do that. I, I would love to see it. Because that's going to be a... A big amount of ships, but uh, just tell me because uh, it's. I currently have four trains, but that's going to be 20 ships, it's insane. Okay, but I think it's not a bad idea, it's going to not make as much money as the train because the train is fairly direct and the money gives you money for um, how is it called in English? Bir birds, birds fly. Uh, so a straight, straight line between the two destinations. Oh, that looks nice. Uh, but yeah, yeah. Please, guys, tell me. Tell me if you want to see 20 ships. <laughs> uh, journeying south of Florida and going to uh, Charlotte. Charlotte. I, re I really hope I'm not butchering this one as well. Uh, anyway, what's going on here? Ooh. We are having a lot of construction material delivered here. Maybe I should do something about that. Let's see, how is Panama doing? 149. No. This one. So only this one is for 148. And I think I'm also trying to deliver construction materials to Miami. For reasons. I think I even set up the... No, that's only a fuel drop. Not construction material drop. Why did I even set up that and then forgot to set up that the, the drop itself? I don't know, but we can very quickly do it because it's here. 
That's two. So it's around here. So we have we have it inside of the drop. Uh, I would take. Where is it? Ram. Buy one of the nice ones. And I need construction material. Okay, this buy and new line. Hey. Can I actually. Can I use this one? What happened here? Miami Fuel Drop. Yep, I think I can combine them. Manage vehicle. Replace it with a combination of the two. I want. I think this. No, not 4x4. Four four. I want 2x2. Two 2x2. By two. Two by two. Where's 2x2? Two two? Four of these. Two this. Construction materials and oil. Replace. And I think I have to manage the line. And in Miami Central Cargo, you load. You don't unload anything. You load construction material and fuel. And here you unload everything. Yeah, 100%. It's fine. By the way, also, why I did do. Why I did that? Full load. Uh, any is fine, I think. Oh, man. Like this. And now, another thing I have to do is I have to increase this line's capacity. And I have to fix this all together. Manage vehicle. Let's see. 15. So each of them is 10. Cargo, construction material. We want the fast ones and I want five, five or six more. One, two, three, four, five. 197. Okay, that works for me. That's perfect. We will see how this goes in the next episode. This is all for today, folks. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. And I would really, really like to discuss anything you want to share. In the comment section also don't forget to like and subscribe i will see you in the next one